Hi, Kelly Clement here from Metastock. In this video, I'm going to talk to you about one of the new trading systems included in Metastock 19 called ETS. Now, ETS is a trading system that has been around for quite a while, but it is a very well proven system for a lot of good reasons. We're going to go ahead and go into those reasons, show you how ETS works. So let's go ahead and jump into it. Now, as we look at um, this, the first thing I do have to do since uh, we're talking about trading systems here is read you a quick disclaimer. So let's go ahead and go through it. This demonstration is designed to instruct you on using Metastock and accompanying software plugins and is not a recommendation to buy or sell, but rather guidelines to interpreting and using specific indicators and features within the software. The information, software, and techniques presented today should only be used by investors who are aware of the risk inherent in trading. Metastock and its employees shall have no liability for any investment decisions based on the use of their software, any trading strategies, or any information provided in connection with the company. Metastock and its employees do not endorse the purchase of any security, nor is it paid for the promotion of any security. No information contained in this presentation should be construed as investment advice or a solicitation to buy any security. So there's our, there's our disclaimer. Let's go ahead and talk about what uh, we're getting into today. So obviously here's all the new features of Metastock 19. The one we're going to be focusing on today is one of the new trading systems in Metastock 19, and that is ETS 2.1. Now ETS was developed by a gentleman named Michael Murmur. Michael Murmur is a very well-renowned author and systems designer who put together this strategy and first put it out for futures trader and then kind of developed it out and grew it for a large base of, of equity traders, FX traders, whatever it is you're trading, because the system is designed to look at some very key features of indicators to help identify trades. We'll get into that. So uh, here's what's included with it. You get the ETS moving average, the ETS trend watch, long and short entry exploration, system test, and experts. So there's a lot with it that is included. The main functions we're going to be focusing on today are the moving average and the trend watch. So this is the way that it looks on a, on a chart. Here's an example of a scan for the ETS enter long. This was on uh, PayPal. Now here you can see that we have an ETS buy. So let's talk about what this is generated off of and how it is designed. Now there's two core functions. One is the moving average, the ETS moving average. We're, we're going to jump ahead here for just a second. And you've got this ETS moving average on the chart. Now, if we talk about moving averages, a lot of us understand the concept of a moving average, but what the ETS does that's a little different than most trading systems in using moving averages, let's go back up here and talk about the trend watch because the trend watch is all based off of what that moving average is doing. It's not just looking at whether it's above or below the price. What it's looking at is it's looking at the slope of the moving average the angle of the moving average, the direction of the moving average. So it's looking at a lot of different aspects of the moving average to try and figure out, okay, well, what is the overall direction of this? But is it an increased angle? Is it above? So there's, there's a lot of calculations underneath. It's not just simply, again, that above and below. So you can see slopes and angles are the essence of successfully trading in the market. So what the trend watch will do is it'll basically give you a binary, hey, it's bullish or it's bearish, based off of all these directions. And he has this great quote that I just absolutely love. The trend is your friend as long as you know what it is. And that's absolutely true. If you know what the trend is, it's easier to trade with it. And that's where Trend Watch is so powerful along with the ETS 2.1. So what will happen is you see this um, Trend Watch indicator down here. And it basically tells you whether it's bullish or bearish by going above or below zero. It will also give you this ribbon that basically just says, hey, here's a quick glance. If you don't want to try and figure out this, uh, if it's above or below, it'll just tell you right here with this ribbon. Okay, so if it's green, it indicates a, a bullish trend. If it's red, it indicates a bearish trend. Simple as that. So it's looking at all that underlying information for you. So this is the moving average again that's used to determine the trend direction, the angle, and the slope of the trend and give you that indication. Now, what's super cool about this system is it's not just, hey, buy here, sell here, buy here. What it's going to do is it's going to tell you when you get an entry signal that you can say, okay, well, this signal's a bullish. It's an enter long. 
So the position is a long one. It's going to tell you when you get into that trade, here's where you should set your stop. Here's where you should set your initial profit target and where you should set your extended profit target. So you've got three layers of information here. You've got your protective stop, which is always good because so many of us struggle with, hey, well, where should I be placing my stop when I get into a trade like this? How should I protect myself? And that's one of the key features, key questions we should be asking ourselves as traders to help us protect our profits, okay? Then we've got a profit target again and that initial profit target help you along the way. Very powerful stuff. Now it does include system tests and explorations as we talked about. And I'd like to go in and show you a, a little bit of this. Let's just go in here to the Explorer. We'll look for a skin. Now one of the great things I love about uh, newer versions of Metastock here is this search, how the search is brought forward. So I can just search ETS and in 19, we brought that even more forward so you can easily find what you're looking for. So we'll just do an ETS long and let's go down and let's maybe look at the S&P 100 in this example. Okay, and we'll just go ahead and start our exploration. And if we have any hits here, then I'll go in and I'll show you how we can actually apply it to the chart. We actually did get one. So we can just go ahead and open up Verizon here. And an easy way to apply this and get all the information you need is just to apply the ETS template. So we'll just right click and we'll go ETS, go to the ETS trading system. And that will apply. There is our entry right there. Then we will just go on and put on the commentary window. And again, commentary window is one of my uh, favorite features in, uh, in 19. Oh, I've got it sitting over here from a, from a previous video. Let's go ahead and bring it up. Expert, view that commentary. There we go. Let's go ahead and dock it right here so we can see it. Let's right click, we'll dock. Okay. So there's my buy. So here's my protective stop. So the entry here is that we're at 40.88. So the stop is at 39.13. Initial profit target 42.63 and extended is at 49.79. Okay, very easy to use, very easy to identify those opportunities. I could go and system test this as well. We're not gonna do that in this video, but this is a great way where you can identify those opportunities. I hope you enjoyed this brief presentation on ETS 2.1. If you have any questions on it, give us a call at 800-882-3040. Uh, chat with us at metastock.com, uh, metastock.com slash sales chat, or email us at sales at metastock.com. Thanks for watching, and thanks for stopping by.